Peace, Ashe, Shalom, Assalamu Alaikum, Hotep, Ashe, to all my believers here on All CNI News. Quick discussion, something I had on my mind and soul is me, I'm in Rosette, Hey, Ru, Hotep. You feel me? Here to talk about this God Jesus situation. And this, to point out a few things. Like in the Garden of Eden, when Jesus, when God, excuse me, when God commanded Adam and Eve not to eat from the tree of knowledge. So was God trying to hide something? Or is man trying to hide something? Just like what the so-called serpent told Eve that ye should never die. He told her she was like God. Same elements. And then later on, we come to realize that Jesus made a statement. Ye are all gods. Out of the shell that we live in, out of the shell that we live in, there's an essence, there's a form, there's a life form, there's a light that's forever burning. This flesh is an experience. This flesh is, will not last forever. But this light, this plethora of light, and a lot of, I guess, his, man used it, reduced it to the Star of David. And there's books of Paul, etc., lost books that was not omitted during the uh, Inquisition and during the... Uh, uh, the, the inclusion and the exclusion of certain books. There are certain books that reveal that. If you look in the Old Testament, the God, the jealous God that was in the Old Testament, then you look at the story of Satan, which he was cast out of heaven. They said he was one of the most beautiful angels in heaven. And there was a war in heaven. So what, the, what was that war about? That war was between the good and the evil right there, between God and Satan in heaven. That was the first war. So this God individual, I have to question, why? In the Old Testament, he killed generations. He was brutal. He changed in the New Testament for some reason, but in the Old, he was brutal. Satan, once again, left this guy. Why would anyone leave the most high the, the creator that's impossible why would one rebel maybe there's a different story we need to check out have you ever thought about that the flesh is a prison this experience is a prison and it's and it's and it has a warden god now just think why wasn't man allowed to eat off of the tree of knowledge? And then you go back to the phrase, God bless the child that holds his own. To make a long story short, we're part of a life force. Will. Through will and through light, we came into existence. We're all Controlled by this one light. We all guided by this one light. Jesus, they call Satan the light of dawn. And they call Jesus was considered to be the light of man. Light, vibrations, frequencies, currencies, ohms. We're people of light. But man and other entities are working to control us and enslave us mentally physically emotionally their job is to enslave us and not to let us know that we are gods we operate on the same frequencies because this light force it's incredible, and we all have those capabilities. We all stars, we all light. 
You don't need a walk of fame in Hollywood. You don't need to have a job in Hollywood to be a star. People, we are stars. We're created in his image. God, that's a child that holds his own, meaning that he gave us seven senses or even more, maybe eight. And we have to utilize those senses. People, we have to wake up and stop allowing our oppressors to oppress us together. That's God. Peace.